all eyes on one man on the back of a hat-trick will he continue to excel well it really is a city that loves its football i'm talking of course about manchester and it's a real pleasure to be here tonight at old trafford I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Manchester United and they face Luton Town. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. Real chance and keeping it out. determined defending not the best challenge free kick well not quite what he wanted to do with the pass well taking form into consideration this ought to be a mismatch our hosts with the best goal scoring record in the league Stuart whereas their opponents have the worst defence well, Derek, these fans are hoping for a feast of goals today. They've been so inventive going forward and they're up against that leaky defence that you were talking about. Only one outcome for me. Opportunity it is. Chance still on. And there is the goal that gives them a well-merited lead. It had been coming. Well, it's a decent goal, but the defenders certainly played their part. Where were they? They were absolutely all over the place. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? through here and a goal another one two in quick succession no wonder they're celebrating well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and the finish is so clinical he just rolls it past the keeper cool as you like well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes, very quick thinking there. Well, foul play, says the referee. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. And the cross goes in. No two ways about it, a wild, wild attempt. Well, it's so hard to get this right, and he just couldn't adjust his body quickly enough. Almost at half-time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Oh, Derek, this is a big moment here. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. So on with the game again. United in charge. The scoreline threatening to get ugly.
And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Oh, managing to beat him. And still pressing. And the keeper will happily collect that one. So no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. So underway again here, the pendulum having already swung United's way. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. He read the situation defensively, and he's made headway! And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Rashford and Barkley robbed of it and a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up it's Manchester United facing Everton Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. A real opening now. Well, a vital interception to snuff out the danger. Promising pass. And quick thinking defensively. The high press was on, and the chance is on. And his eyes lit up in anticipation of his third goal of the game. Well, the way he's finished today, that was a decent chance. But you just sense the hat-trick is coming. Well, I have to say, United have been a joy to watch today. Just look at those stats. They've been in complete control. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. But I think he knew that was coming. Yellow card it is. Well, that was always going to happen. He needs to control himself now. Otherwise, it could get worse. And that's not what you want to be doing when you've already been booked. Well, that could easily have been deemed a second bookable offence. Well, he has to be more careful than that. That's his last chance, that's for sure. A free kick, and the keeper took it cleanly. Sahar. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Luton Town facing Crystal Palace. And they're making a change. Perfect challenge. Well, a really good run, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. This could be dangerous.
And it's United's turn now. And he keeps going. And defensive play to be applauded. Now, he could be in hot water here, having already been booked. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Can he put it away? And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening, and they played really well. What a performance that was today.